All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. So today we are going to be doing our free summon on the new Project Version Z launch celebration Dokkan Festival banner. Now this banner is extra special because JP never got it before. So for the time being, this is a global, I'm not going to say exclusive because that's not true. I do think JP is eventually going to be getting it, but it's definitely a global first banner, and for now, a global only banner. So yeah, that's pretty exciting, and obviously not trying to throw shade at my JP players out there, we're all one big family, not trying to start a war, but it's just, it's cool when global gets things first, because usually it's JP that gets the new units and events before global, right? So anyways, uh, with that said, let's take a quick look at the featured units, and uh, we're starting off with Int Super Saiyan 3 Bardock, we have STR Jiren, uh, Tech Vegito Blue, STR Rose, Int Angel Golden Frieza, Fizz Super Vegito, Tech Super Saiyan 3 Broly, STR Ultimate Gohan, Int Ultra Instinct Goku, Fizz Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks, Int Super Gogeta, uh, STR Super Janemba, Tech Super Saiyan 3 Angel Goku, Int Kid Buu, uh, AGL Super 17, Fizz Final Form Cooler, Tech Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, Fizz Omega Shenron, STR Super Saiyan 4 Goku, AGL Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, and STR Perfect Cell. In total, if my math is correct, or my counting is correct, there are 21 featured SSRs, all of them are Dokkan Festival units, and uh, for the most part, they're all quite good, especially the units that have Extreme Z Awakenings right now, like any of the 120 leads are great pulls. Um, I would say the best ones are the Fizz Cooler, the uh, Super Saiyan 4s, the Super Saiyan 4 Goku and Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta are insanely, insanely powerful. And the Cell's not bad. Um, what else? I mean, the Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta and the Omega Shenron need Extreme Z Awakenings, but I feel like that's probably going to happen sometime this year, so they will get very, very good in the near future, and yeah, the 120 leads are great, um, Gogeta is awesome, Gotenks is awesome, the UI Goku is probably, I would argue the best unit on the banner, although, hmm, that's a tough one actually, it's between the Super Saiyan 4s, or Cooler, or this Int UI Goku for the best banner, or sorry, best unit on the banner, the point is, they're all amazing, and uh, these guys, I mean the, the the Gohan, as well as the Vegito, the Angel Golden Frieza, the Rose, the Vegito Blue, the Jiren, and also the Super Saiyan 3 Bardock have a lot of potential with Extreme Z Awakenings. Right now, they have aged kind of poorly, so they're not great anymore, but once again, the fact that we're getting free summons for a banner that features all these great Dokkan Fest units is obviously really nice of Bandai to do. I don't think we've ever had something like this before. It's something I've seen in a lot of other gacha games, but I've never seen a banner quite like this where we get the daily free summon. I mean, Legends. Literally, Legends does this all the time, but Dokkan, I think this is the first time we're getting a free summon daily. Now, when I first heard about this, um, I was a lot more excited because I thought it was a guaranteed featured Dokkan Fest unit with every single. Instead, it's a chance to get one of them, or potentially an unfeatured LR. Uh, there are LRs on this banner. I don't know if they're all here, but I've seen someone pull a uh, LR Go Frieza, Goku and Frieza. So, I mean, at least most of the LRs are here for sure. So uh, yeah, with all that said, guys, why don't we jump right into it? Let's do our free single for the day. And fingers crossed, maybe we pull something useful. That'd be nice. We did get Vegeta flying in. We do go Super Saiyan. If we pull an LR on this single, that would just be crazy. Okay, guys, let's make this a group summon. If you guys haven't done your summon yet, or you're watching this in the future, and you want to summon on something else, then feel free to go ahead and do so in three, two, one. Let it rip. Ooh! Refusing. Okay, so it's either a Dokkan Fest unit or an LR. 
could be both, or rather, one or the other. Let's see it. Okay, fake out. Fake out, here we go. And it's a tech Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. I don't need him, <laughs> but that's cool. That's cool, I'll take it. Um, so there you go, guys. Yeah, every single day from now until I believe February 7th, so about three weeks, about three weeks, we get one single every single day. And then um, I think you can also summon, yeah, you can summon on this banner with stones, which is not something I recommend because I feel like you just have a lot of other much better banners that you should be saving your stones for. So yeah, if you guys are new, if you guys came for the version Z update, um, don't spend too many stones on this banner. Okay, it's not really worth it. What you want to save for are things like the anniversary banners or dual Dokkan Fest in general. Um, you know, New Year step ups, which is still up right now. Yo, if you're a new player and you haven't done your summons on this banner, this is what you should be spending your stones on. This is what you should be saving your stones for because you get a guaranteed good unit for every step of this uh, step up and you can do three rounds so for anybody that's a new player anybody trying to you know just build out their box and trying to get good leaders this is the banner for you okay but with that said uh this banner is pretty cool man this banner is pretty cool and i don't want to get too optimistic but i think there's maybe a chance just maybe that they're trying to hint to us that the vegeto blue and the rose are getting Extreme Z Awakenings soon. I don't know when. Um, maybe. I mean, on JP for the anniversary, there's gonna be most likely a Vegito Blue and a Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta for their dual Dokkan Fest. So possibly they do like one on JP and then one on Global at the same time. Maybe JP gets Rose. And then Global gets Vegito Blue. I mean, that's just wishful thinking, because I would much rather have Vegito Blue first on Global, but we'll see. This is just wild speculation. Um, I could be completely off, but I'd be very happy if uh, one or both of these guys, the Vegito Blue and the Rose, get their Extreme Z Awakening soon, especially the Vegito Blue, because this guy, I mean, he has the potential to become the hardest hitting unit in the game by like a decent margin if they build them correctly. And then Rose, of course, you know, will still be very, very good. But I think Vegito Blue is gonna blow him out of the water. Just like the uh, previous pairing, right? For Fizz Vegito Blue and AGL Rose. AGL Rose is good. AGL Rose is fine with the Extreme Z Awakening, but Vegito Blue is like so much better, right? I don't think anybody can dispute how much better Fizz Vegito Blue is than AGL Rose. So I think this is going to be a similar situation, or maybe they'll try to, you know, get them closer in performance. But, man, I hope uh, those EZAs are in the near future. But anyways, uh, I'm rambling. The point is, we got this new Project Version Z banner. Do your one free single every day. We're getting about two multis worth of free summons. And uh, I got pretty lucky today. I mean, of course, I didn't get something I needed, but we got a Dokkan Fest unit right off the bat. So clearly, it's possible. I wish you guys the best of luck. Let me know in the comments what you guys pulled, whether it was an Outlar or a Dokkan Fest unit or an R, Yamcha, or whatever else it may be. Feel free to flex on me in the comments down below. And uh, yeah, enjoy version Z, man. I love this update. There are so many just positive changes to the game, uh, including this, including the auto system, including the hidden potential system, even the different colored categories is nice. Could have put the categories in alphabetical order. I don't think it would have been that hard, but nonetheless, they're clearly trying. I look forward to whatever else they have in store for us. And uh, yeah, that's all I gotta say, guys. That's gonna be the video. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel. If you're new, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.